All right, chat. Welcome directly, instantly, literally, literally didn't even do anything off screen. I've just stood here for a couple seconds, went and got a drink, came back. Welcome back to Elder Woods Supernova Part 25. I did notice that we did drop a couple frames last episode. I'm sorry, I don't know what to tell you. It sucks. Um, so it may happen again this episode. I know most people don't mind if I drop a couple throughout the stream. It's I hate when I'm like lagging hard, but like it's just my internet company right now. It's the, also it's disgusting out. So honestly, it might be a lot to do with the fact that it's disgusting out in Canada right now. Didn't really think of it that way, but it is. It is absolutely terrible out right now, and it's just not fun. So map region. We want to go to Cascadia. I think you can actually can you go out s this side of the town we're currently at Cascadia right so we don't want to move yeah we don't want to move that's what we're gonna do we need to Candace cradle this episode Um, let's see here. How far do we actually have to go? Okay, load. Um, should put a head straight this way, if I recall. I think you can get out of here this way. Watch me be wrong, and I didn't take the right way, and I have to go to Stellar Bay. Hopefully we don't drop so many frames. I, 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 I skimmed through the episode and saw like four or five, so it wasn't... Couldn't have been that bad. I apologize if it is. It's the best I can do. It's, a, it's either that or I don't record episodes. Um, and I don't have a video video for the... I say tonight. It was actually uh, tomorrow. See, even... Um, Twitch Inspector tells me I'm not lagging enough for my stream to be considered laggy. I do watch the odd frame drop. Like, absolutely one, then like ten minutes, Ready, then one, boss. then ten minutes. Then it sucks, but... I don't mind it. Well, thanks, chat. Seems, seems chat doesn't mind too much, but... See, I usually don't. Mantis one spit. Is that what's happening? I didn't actually know they could do that. One, all right. I need more Adreno. I think I'll be okay for a little bit, but I do need more. I'll be okay for this episode, I'd imagine. But I need more Adreno. Chat. Exclamation point remind me to buy Adreno.
stop attacking my companions, I'm looting. This is a rock. It looks like something else, I don't know. Like, God knows what, but. Also, that. Like, literally, this. Oh, God, it's breathing. Oh, God. What if I get inside it? Oh, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. <laughs> Fat figure. So what the actual plan is... At least at the moment... Is to give the thing to... Sanjar? But I need to talk to the other person first. I need to go to Amber Heights. Which means we really should just walk back... Can I fast travel right now? Well, and well, near hostiles. Okay. Let's run over here. I will, I need to go somewhere close to Amber Heights. I think Stellar Base is still close to Amber Heights. They're not far from each other. So I'll probably just land there. And then we'll, um, yeah, I should, so I can teleport to my ship after being at Amber Heights. Then I can go right from my ship to Stellar Bay, which is right in Stellar Bay. Got it, that's the plan. <laughs> but, yes, I will, um... That's definitely what I will do. I need to talk to the the Amber Heights people first, because I need to get the girl to agree to uh, betray her map. I think that's possible. I can get her to betray the leader and then get her people to join with the other people and they become a thing. We are now in orbit above Stellar Bay, Captain. No blockade is a match for my pipe skills. I should probably upgrade my companions. Yeah, you're right. Thinking about it, I don't think they have any good weapons. They're, like, using level, like, 10 weapons and, like, level 15 armor, and I'm level 28 or 27 or something like that right now. Most enemies are 20s, so they're a little underpowered. You're not wrong, chat. I think you're right about that. I should probably do that soon.
Yeah, we're not talking... Uh, Sanjar yet. Because I don't think... I think I don't want him to actually, like, make any moves. I think this is the right order to, to do things, chat. I definitely want them to join forces. I want them to join forces. I think that would make, that'd make me happy. Last time I had them killing each other, and and I, I felt like I had to choose, so I chose the, the settlement over... Uh, I, I chose to kill the Iconoclasts. I think the Iconoclasts' ideals should survive. Their leader should, like, step down. I don't, he sh I don't think he should die. Necessarily. If we just go forward from Stellar Bay for a bit and then end up over here with Graham, we'll be good. So we'll end up. I miss every shot. Gordon, who's next? Nobody? Yeah, that's what I thought. Heads up, boss! I don't think I've ever been through this path, actually. Huh? One just not so clear. You not? I just want to go somewhere. And you're just every, every single every single enemy on Monarch is like, huh? Are you there? I will attack you. I don't care. Like I fought you guys thousands of times. I'm getting sick of it. It's getting boring. Like, <laughs> I'm over it. Like literally. These count as hiding spots? I don't think so. These do, you can tell. And hopefully Zora will listen to us. That's the idea. I upload last night. Oh god, I actually feel like I didn't. Oh my god, I didn't. Look at me go. That's fantastic. It's technically just now, just now been 24 hours, so I wasn't really behind. I actually technically doubled uploaded the day before, that's why. It was like, I only waited a couple hours before I threw out the next video. I don't usually do that, it depends on what I'm uploading. If it's like completely separate or something like that, that's why. So, right after this episode, when I'm done making this one and streaming, I'll probably upload what I have to, which will be a. Uh, I'll throw up uh, Outer Worlds, I think. The gunship. Have you secured its target? No, actually, I don't want to talk to you. I'm sorry.
Holy shit. I don't want to read through all this, but I know that these are important. I need to talk to Zora. Where are you? Where's Zora? Isn't she like the medic? Kind of? Bob Bones? Where does she hang out? I need to talk to Huxley here. I don't think I've ever talked to a Huxley. But yeah, I really don't know where she is. Where is she? Hey, Captain. I need your help, and we ought to keep it hush-hush. You know about what happened here, right? The history of Amber Heights? I read about this in Thrilling Tales of the Frontier. Pirates raided Amber Heights. It was a real bloodbath. Right. Common belief is that the pirates fled to an old relay station that had already been abandoned, but nobody could find them. The station's locked up, but one of my people found an old data cartridge in a nearby wrapped nest. It's mostly corrupted, but I pulled a couple codes off of it. One is the code to the Amber Heights gate. I don't recognize the other, but it's similar. I bet it opens a door. Right. The access codes to Amber Heights. What gets me is... If this belonged to the pirates, that means they knew someone... If someone gave them the gate code, all those deaths, Captain. All that blood is on their hands. Just a warning. The area is infested with mantisaurs. I'd send some help, but we're, you know, preparing for war. I appreciate it. Here's the code. If it works, bring back anything you find. Supplies are best, but information's good too. If someone was behind the Amber Heights massacre, they'd give a lot of people around here some closure to find out who and string them up. Good luck. Watch out for the Taros. Oh, this is where I find out that he's actually betrayed and they're like in on it together. Yeah, if I recall. That's something, something like that. So we're gonna go do that quickly, because I'd like to do that. I have to equip that quest, that would be a good idea. Let's go do that quick. Can we... Uh, I was like stuck on a wall, bro. Bro, I opened the wrong app by accident. Alright, outpost is 500 meters. It only takes like a minute or two. As long as there's not too many enemies in the way. We can sneak past most. Oh, that's the 
last of them. What? That's what I was trying to do the whole time. They glitched out, it was weird. Must be MSI's work. They got a knack for burning bridges. Well, this doesn't help me much, does it? I end up back over here. Yeah, let's see what happens if I go over here. You know, so I walked right up to that, confused about what it was. <laughs> I, I genuinely did, so I walked straight up to that. Oh, am I really going to deal with this for a while? Oh, cleanse, please? I didn't think that would work. Shh. Actually, how long is this in effect? Bro, why am I actually still... Okay, kinda dumb that a mine can do that to you. Just wanna say that. Just wanna say that. Oh my fuck, chat. Like, what do I do? How is this entertaining as a let's play? Like, how is this fun to watch? Why am I perma-crippled? I'm not sure. I've never been stunned by something that does that much. Oh, I'm encumbered. Okay, wait, what? How am I encumbered? Why did I lose so much carry capacity? Like, I lost so much. I know that's because I'm beginning to buff, but like, that's a lot. Like, I, I went from having like 180 to 130. That's a lot of carry lost. Like, a lot. Like, an absolutely ridiculous amount of carry lost. What I should do. I think it'd be quicker, maybe. I don't know. I can probably just run all the way up here. I was gonna teleport to my ship, then teleport to Fallbrook, and then walk from there. Oh, you notice me? I'm gonna be mad. I'm just trying to do something here. I could help this guy, right? Let's do that, maybe. I never do help this guy. There's like a Manta Queen here, right? Quite a few soldiers, really. Oh well. Let's go. I'm in. How do you not die? Wait for reload. If I may be so bold. Well, now, wait a minute. I still hear those sores crying across the way. How is it you're here and they're still alive? Evidently so, stranger. I don't suppose you'd mind stopping a minute and helping me out? Those beasts don't seem to want to leave. I'm of the mind they need forceful convincing.
which beasts. No, actually, though. Ones I just killed? Is there a couple more up ahead? Like, yeah, there's a couple more, I guess. Is, is, is that all? Or are you just being picky now? Ah, blessed silence at last. Okay, yeah, we're good. I appreciate the assistance. Name's Weston. Every once in a while, I set up shop along these here roads. You find yourself in need of resupply, you come on by. Care to purchase a thing or two? Oh, sure. Tell me what you got, I guess. What is that thing in there? Tumors from a cyst pig? Okay. I don't know, man. You got like a lot of water, I guess. And I'm like, what do I need from you? Nothing, really. Like. I really don't need to go up this way, so I'll just go this way and not fight queens for no reason. Waste of energy, like, uh, like my gun energy, is what it's wasting it. Like, I have to repair it all the time if I keep killing things. That's what it's coming down to. I may get XP, but I'm getting to the point where I just want, don't want to waste weapon parts. I have billions. I can get thousands, literally. I can probably get a thousand something weapon parts at this point. Just by breaking down all the weapons I have in my uh, ship. But, it's a pain in the ass is what it is, so... Mega Mantasaur's like, sup? So, Mega, Pillar, and a Soldier. Not too worried about that. Don't move, and I can still get another shot off. Stagger it again with that. He should be basically dead or dead. Okay. Didn't expect to see you, but maybe we're okay. I can get Felix back if they die. Holy shit, we all lived. When they get to the higher level, the companions can get tanky. A little. Not hugely, but a little. I mean, I ride them over encumbered again. Why am I losing so much still? Oh, that's my shock stick. I don't want to break that down yet. Oh, I'm getting some of it back. That's what's happening. Okay, we're good. What did I just pick up? Hemlock's eye patch. Oh, okay. I didn't check what its actual effects were. Let's check. Uh, clothing, sneak attack damage plus 10%. Huh. I don't think it's worth having over my helmet. But that's pretty decent, I guess. Considering I snipe a lot, right? You'd think that'd be useful to me. One of those things where if I keep it on me and use it like... Uh, this would be really, like, pain in the ass. Equip it, then shoot someone in the head like a sneak attack. And I'd be like, haha, and then I take it, and then I equip the helmet again, so I have more damage resistance. Great work. How much am I over encumbered? By five. I'll just break down some armor I picked up. There's so much of it here.
a vending machine in here? No? Holy messages. This is one of the ones I think... Old data cultures found in the remains of an old helpless mummy, given the rest of the sulfur degradation in the year spent sitting in dirt and dust. It'll be a miracle if anything can be found in this. Those are always interesting to see it. Sorry, I don't know if I read that way too fast. <laughs> Probably did, but whatever. Try to make our way back to them. Oh god, that's a queen with a name. Yeah, I really don't want to fight you right now. I don't actually know if I can kill you, to be honest. This sucks. I just want to get back to my objective. Stay down there. Why did I do that? Why did I even think that going up was smart? I want to be down here on the road so I can go around. You're not. They seem to lose you quicker when you do this, so. Okay, they'll lose it just to me in a sec. Returning fire. Work. Yeah. Now that was fun. It's almost like the game wants to convince you fighting was fun sometimes, when the Felix is like, Oh my god, that was fun. It really wasn't, Felix. We killed the enemies that we've killed about 19 times. <laughs> it looks like it's like 9 p.m. Outside, because it's so, like, dark and musky and just gross out in Canada right now. It looks like it's 9 p.m. and it's 3.50. It looks so, like, dark and gr It looks like it's bedtime. Welcome back. You find anything out there?
Let's see. These are old. Looks like correspondences between the pirates. Some bits here, some there, some... Wait. This... This one's got the Amber Heights gate code on it. Just like the one I found earlier. And here's... A letter. Wait, this is from Graham. Oh, of all the... Captain. He gave them the gate codes. Yeah. He did. He really did. I know he's got his head in the clouds, but... I always believed there was a core of good there. What the hell happened to live and let live? I always figured Mr. Bryant for a man of character. In the end, though, he was just another name on a long list of frauds. Yeah. He had us all fooled. Now I've got to sort out how to break it to the rest of my people. Look, I need to think. Plan. Figure out if I should talk to him or shoot him. Or both. Just don't give him the module yet. Give me a little time. I'll meet you at his place. Watch out. So, I think... I want to go up and talk to them and hopefully not cause a massive war. I'm pretty sure I can convince them to not go to a massive war. I don't have my good hat on me. Well, that sucks, but... My speech should be pretty high right now, right? Still, even though I'm losing some stats. Let's go make sure it's pretty decent. It's still 100. Persuade is still 100. I'm going to buff all my stats in case I need to use, like, lie and stuff. Buff as many stats as I can here. Let's think about what I have to use. All right, and then use that for personality. The have you secured its targeting module? When I founded the Iconoclasts, I did so amidst the ghosts of this planet's past. Since then, many have asked me, why here? Were you involved in the massacre? Was that some gruesome plot to clear a path for my dreams? My response to you is the same as to all others. The death of MSI was an incidental tragedy. I'd have walked this path with or without it. I did no such thing. Their deaths came in the night while I slept in Stellar Bay. And regardless, we're discussing a past long since left behind. Those ghosts still haunt me. But they needn't curse my people. When the entire colony has embraced our truth, perhaps then the perpetrator will come into the light. Until then... Uh, you did it, buddy. It does us no good to dwell on past mistakes. Someday judgment will pass on us all, Captain. The universe aligns itself even as we speak. For now, our sights must remain on spreading our message. Let us speak no more of this. The gunship. Have you secured its targeting module? All right. The gunship. Wait, so how do I even go about this? Wait. I have to talk to her first. Did I did I not did I miss something? Go take a walk, Captain. I'll find you once my head's on straight. Oh. So I don't know what to do for the last little bit of this uh, episode then. Because I'm just supposed to wait for her to contact me, I guess? Let's find out in a second.
Well, if they don't contact me anytime soon, I will just, uh... I don't remember how you get her to contact you. I don't, I don't, actually, I wouldn't know because I've never done this path, so. So to end this episode, well, a little bit longer, we're going to play a little longer. We're going to the Unreliable, and we're going to quickly as possible, um, go to that, uh, thing for Sublight and get it for them, because I do want to do that. Because again, we're not allying with the board anyway, so I don't care if that quest botches early, because I don't have any interest in actually doing it, so. I don't want to kill, um, uh, what's that fucking place called? I was going to call it Stother Bay, no. Um, I don't want to kill the people of, uh, Emerald Vale, no. Edgewater? I want that place to stay. I want it to stay. I don't think the board would have a very good plan anyways. I don't, the board is lost. They're, they're, they deserve to go. Let's go to HRS 1084. This is what we're doing for the rest of the episode, Chad, is this basically. We've reached HRS-1084, Captain. It's emitting a very weak dark Fucking signal. I almost missed. Almost mistaked it for static. Yada yada yada. We know, we know. It's weak and not using its systems. In Titus Andridicus. Here, Captain. I just as soon leave it cold, dark, and derelict. Good uh, time to pause if you want to read that. Store power. These autos. We poke around too much, they might wake up. Yeah, okay. Dodged. Going silent. Ow. That's not fair. It was basically in the way I had to shoot it. Let me guess, I'm over encumbered now because of okay. I wanna walk around for a bit. We're not in a massive hurry. Another research station, I think, by the looks of it, in the end. That's what it looks like it was supposed to be. Majority of doors seem sealed. I don't remember how to actually i I've done this before, I just don't remember everything about it. How am I supposed to get lighter right now? If I drink liquor, will I gain... Oh. That's not Fallout, so... Yeah, let's drink some sugar for a bit. Apparently that goes to strength. God damn it. What I get for not paying attention. Who leaves mines all over this shit anyways? Oh, I see you have activated your holographic shroud, Captain. Excellent. Becoming indistinguishable from an authentic UDL trooper will prove advantageous to your current situation. A UDL vessel has been tracking our position and just recently docked with the station. They are patching into the station's transmission lines now. 
I cannot stop. I've been waiting for this day since we tagged your ship in Cascadia, Captain. I... Wait, who are you? No one told me we had security forces deployed on the station already. Roger that. Just as a precaution, I'm sure you won't mind if we turn on the station security systems. Can't be too careful. We hate to leave this location undefended after a close call with outlaws. Shit. Thanks for the warning. Last thing I need is to get fined for overriding security on a restricted station. My team and I will just head out then. The UDL gunship is undocking from the station. They appear to be departing into space. Go, boss. You got a real fine way with words. Absolutely dominated. Get out of here in a second. I didn't know you could actually uh, get out of this situation that easily. I didn't know you could. Uh, it worked out that I happen to have a board key card already. Encumbered again. I think I'll just drink a little more sugar. I just want to get back to my ship so I can like sort that stuff out myself. Yeah, I can just get back to my ship now. Where actually is my ship? Just over here, right? in there. Bruh, why am I always over encumbered? Please stop, I don't want to drink all my sugar drinks. Chat, this is getting on my nerves. Be the finest agent sublight ever hired. Chertrand. Chertrand. I've seen that name before somewhere. Cascadia, right? Mm hmm. Scientist. Well, that's a lockpick 100 door, damn. I wonder what the hell's in there. Alright, ship's this way, chat. I guess I'll quickly. What do I want higher? Let's 
take a perk that buffs. Wait, you know what I should take? It's been on my nerves for a while, like carry capacity issues, so. Like, again, if I really want to respect my end game, if I need to respec, I'll respect. So I'll just take carry capacity. It was bothering me. Like, 100 kilograms of carry capacity is like. It'll solve my problem for the rest of the game, probably. It's only a problem right now because I haven't sorted my inventory in like two episodes. Crew members Ellie and Max are engaged in a heated discussion in the kitchen. Let's go to the groundbreaker. We've arrived at the groundbreaker. Felix and Yoko are the ones I did the job with, so I'll take them with me, even though I'd rather take Bavardi because I like Bavardi. But yeah, after we uh, gain the next quest, I'll end the episode. And I think next episode what we'll do is we'll um, start doing this quest where we, like, do the stuff for her, like Lilia. Um, we will fail at a certain point. I th oh, will we? Should I kill the scientist? I don't want to kill the scientist. I like the scientist. I don't know, man. We'll decide when we get there. Because I've never gone with, like, Lilia's quest, I've never went past the point of killing the scientist. Because I don't know what happens past that. I don't know if there's more, there's probably more missions to do, like, a couple more of them. Or even if that one's the last one, it, they give you something for it. Um. I've never went in there and just shot her. I've always been like, oh yeah, you're totally right, there's no aliens, and then told Lilia she's wrong, and then she fires you. So. I want to at least go to the point of getting fired by uh, you, the uh, sublight people. You know what else I should do to get rid of some weight? Chat. Sell that shit off. I'm at 16 grand, by the way. I could actually tinker my weapons up even further, which I probably will have to do for endgame anyways. Because uh, if I want to use whatever I'm using now... Off to make it even stronger and find some better armor. I can probably get some hundred plus reduced distance armor at this point. I should really go find my armor somewhere else, like a higher level, and just respec it back up. That's probably what I'll have to do before endgame. I'm not worried about that quite yet, but before the last big fights at endgame, I should really respec my armor and make it stronger. Finally, a base of our own. Soon we'll have eyes on every corner of the system. Well done, Captain. I'll have those dismantled. You can never be too careful when moving into someone else's territory. Aside from the automated security, did you meet any resistance at the station? <sighs> I knew it. They've been shadowing us since Monarch. Maybe even longer. I've been less than honest you with not? you. That's it? Your assignments weren't strictly about the salvage business. We might have figured that out already. That's right. Up until now, I've kept you in the dark for your protection, and more importantly, mine. But I'd like to think we've earned each other's trust. After the Monarch job, I started connecting the dots. I didn't like the picture. Then what we found at Station 1084 confirmed my fears. You and I have stumbled onto something big, something none of us were meant to know. I'm thinking more along the lines of the sapient species paradox. Oh, I read about that in one of my magazines. She's talking about aliens, right? Ask yourself why a skeleton crew was studying that Alta Vitae gas in secret. Ask yourself why stockpiles were hidden on a planet full of monsters.
No. They were hiding something the colony isn't ready to know. Before we go any further, I want you to keep an open mind. Can you do that for me, Captain? Aliens. I'm talking about aliens. They're the ones responsible for the deaths at 1084, and who knows what else. We have to put a stop to it. I knew it. Aliens from other worlds been visiting Halcyon. At least one of your crew can keep an open mind. But this isn't some Aetherwave serial, Millstone. This is reality. I'm saying it's aliens. I'm not asking you to like it. I'm not even asking you to believe it. But I need to act on this threat to the colony, and I can't do it alone. Right. I'm done. I'm officially tuning you out until such time as I hear the words payment and or shooting. Damn, she's serious. Tragic, ain't it? What age does to your mental faculties? The crew is skeptical. That's good. I don't want you walking into the unknown with blindfolds on. I assume you have questions? If we're gonna see this through, I'll need your trust and commitment. Now's the time for setting doubts aside. Dr. Chartrand is the crooked psychopath behind the gas experiments. She sold out her species, and I need you to put a bullet through her skull. No questions asked, boss? I like your style. This keycard will get you through the front door of her Byzantium estate. Don't ask how I got it. You might not like the answer. By now, the other side knows That's what you're doing. Don't trust anything Chartrand says. She's compromised down to the bone. Maybe even deeper than that. Oh god, how hot. Alright, we're definitely not doing that, but... Read that if you want it. Uh, we're done. This is where I'm going to uh, end the episode. Next episode, we will go to... I don't know if I want... Oh, I'll figure out what I want to do with this quest. I don't know. I'm not going to make any promises till next time. I'll see you guys for episode 26. 26? Well, we'll continue doing a couple more quests. There's only a few more left in the game. That I can think of off by heart. And we'll hit Monarch up at some point to see if Zora will let us finish that other quest. Because, um... I really can't finish it right now. Like I said, I'm not even allowed, so... I'll see you guys for that. Moving!